Well, good day again to everyone who is interested in getting familiar with uh, old style artillery. Uh, I start with, uh, with the editor because uh, for the next uh, lesson we will need some extra stuff. What we, what we namely need is a, is a, is a boussole, is an is a artillery aiming circle because in this lesson we are going to learn how to orient our gun using how to orient simply our gun using an artillery boussole and not the aiming circle that is the PAB2M type Russian very old Russian artillery uh, aiming circle it is in the advanced artillery system you see here on the right side advanced artillery system inventory and you have this folded aiming circle PAB2M fold you just put behind you and you should be just fine uh, let's play the scenario and I will show you uh, what to do with that aiming circle here we, here we are with your good old trusty D38 beautiful gun and here is our aiming circle well <coughs> uh, this is a this tutorial is about uh, orienting your gun using the aiming circle and and the and the terrain feature to do that obviously what you need you can do it without a map so uh, obviously you need your terrain feature let's stick with the with the previous one this is the on the vest I have this uh, group of houses and on the north part we have this bar and the north edge of this bar will be our orientation point just as it was in the last time you see that what is the bar what we see that is the house that is a small house and that is the bar and that is the northern edge of the bar put it that is going to be a red dot and let's make it let's call it op just as we called it before that is going to be our orientation point go back to the gun and point your periscope point your gun not your, not just your periscope point your gun that's was stupid I just shut my gun and yeah and point your gun your entire gun make sure your periscope is looking at 30 zero zero that means it's totally parallel with the barrel and uh, and in that way we can just uh, align our sight with the well that's pretty that's the closest I can get let's align our sight with our uh, orientation point let's get out of the gun we take our aiming circle boussole it's called in Russian and uh, it is on the vest so it's let's go back the further you go the better it will be you see I see the house now I'm just going going the third <coughs> Well, 50 meters should do just fine, but uh, the more you go, the more accurate your readings will be. So anyway, just make sure you keep the house and the gun in check. And the final adjustment you do with your binocular, you see? Here is, our, here is the, aim, the periscope of the gun, and here is our reference point. What we do is we need to go a little bit left. And that's it that should be just fine okay and what we do now is we put together the aiming circle PAB2M how do we do it we do the interaction CTRL window key and with the equipment we set up the aiming circle PAB2M well it is our beautiful aiming circle and let's see if the aiming circle is aligned well we go into it and with a right mouse click we get into the optics and you see yeah not pretty not pretty, pretty. we need to go you see that's where our uh, periscope is and what's where our reference point is so we need we need to move a little bit on the left to be aligned totally and perfectly on the left so what you do is you go you bring up the interaction menu you carry good uh, where you carry it's a little bit left not much put it down let's check it again 
Well, uh, we carried it probably way too far, so we need to go back right. Well, this is a <laughs> this is a this is a game. Carry. Not much. Let's check it. Wow, a little bit more, right? Let's check it. Well, more, right? I know. I yeah, probably I need to be parallel with the when I pick up I, 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 I need to be totally aligned. I don't want to name it, I want to carry it. Let's check. Again, well, getting there, just uh, just a little more. <laughs> a little more. That's uh, what. <laughs> That is not easy, and that's pretty much in the real life you do the same, but um, with a helper, not alone. It's still, it's still not good. Still a little bit right. Yeah, a little bit right. That's perfect, you see? Uh, now our aiming circle, the orientation point, and the periscope is aligned perfectly. All we have to do now is I have to find out with the aiming circle what is the angle what is this angle what we are aligned at all these three points are aligned in one angle and we are going to find out at what angle in order to do that we need to change the view with the aiming circle that's the plus or minus key with the with the plus key you go to the uh, to the uh, to the readings of the aiming circle and with plus you go to the compass of the aiming circle in order to read perfectly the uh, the angles obviously you have to orient your uh, aiming circle to the north well you just with the arrow keys you just rotate if you want to rotate more you can push the shift and it starts to at a, at a point yeah when it starts to get to the to the two points align that means you are a north well not yet well so that's now a little bit now right that should be just fine and that should be left well these two that is going to be just perfect I guess yeah now our aiming circle is pointed to the north we need to go back to the optics rotate our optics back to our gun look into it well, align it perfectly. Good. I always, uh, I usually release the mouse when I align because the slightest movement in our with our mouse it will destroy our reading. So this is this is the uh, this is the scale of the Bob 2M aiming circle. What you need to how you need to read it. Why well, you have these two 
letters. One is the, 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 the black one, it is B, that is for Busol. Uh, it's in Russian, that's the aiming circle. And the U, uh, is uh, the red is the U, it's a Russian U, which means Ugl. Uh, this means basically angle. Uh, this is an angle, in me angle measuring this device, but at this point we are only interested in the black one. Uh, how we are interested in the black one? I will show you how to read these things. You see? That's what we see on that picture, the busol. In this part of the scale, you can read the the azimuth where the busol or the aiming circle is looking at. Here, here you, you read the big digits. That is going to be, you see, uh, in this case, this is 2, 3, 4, that is 3. That is the O3, or not 3, just O3, because we, we, we always have to be very precise in artillery and you have to pronounce all the four digits what you are looking at so you, you you would not say just three it's o three or zero three that's the big digits zero is the thousands three are the hundreds and here you read the tens and the ones how you read the tens and the ones well that's it's simple that is ten you see that's zero ten twenty so that would be ten and one two three four five six so it's sixteen so it is 16 you see it's it's 0 3 16 that you that is your reading here well let's go to our busol now and read our reading you see our uh, black b is standing at 45 and the uh under the right side the rotating scale it's standing at what zero four so our reading is 45 zero four To get out and that's just how it is it's just simple your uh, go back to the map and you already know that your orientation point is is the azimuth is uh, 45 04 you see that's how simple it is uh, measuring uh, uh, the angle of your uh, barrel and uh, uh, precisely it's very precise it's very precise and precisely determine the uh, uh, exact azimuth of your barrel <coughs> uh, that's how much I wanted to tell you about this um, you need to practice it a little bit and you will get good at it have a wonderful day